All right, everybody. Welcome, welcome uh, to another episode of King's Cave 80. Uh, thank yeah, you. For, yep. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for, for, for joining, for tuning in. Uh, we always appreciate your support. Um, thank you. Thank you so much today. Today we have a, a guest. It's a local guest. It's an H-Town uh, collector. <laughs> H-Town uh, connection. Uh, yes, yes, yes. Uh, let's let's welcome uh, Ignacio. Woo! Thank you, brother. Appreciate I, you for having me here. No, nah, absolutely. Thank bro. you absolutely, for inviting man. me out here. Absolutely, man. No, no, I appreciate you. Thank you for your yeah, time. You say out here, you make it seem like you, you drove a good distance, right? <laughs> like, yeah. About 50 miles. Yeah. About 50, yeah. man, it took about that's, 40 minutes to get out here. That's this what everybody feels says. Like you're in the Houston yeah. traffic. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, said, I said I live in Houston, but people people, people seem not to. He, he lives in Dallas. People seem, yeah, seem not to agree <laughs> that I live in Houston. But uh, nah, thank you for driving, man. Thank you for coming by. I appreciate um, you. I appreciate you. Um, well, to, well I, 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 know, I know you were like, oh, like, Oh man, this is wild. I'm nervous, but no, nah, but don't be. We were just we're just a couple of friends talking. Mm -hmm. We've been talking for, for about an hour before this. Yeah, yeah. Before the Isaiah's the decided ice. to came on, the father the Isaiah's, you know, start saying the father cameras. Yeah, 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 yeah like, <laughs> the, finish his nap and, and everything. Like, how yep. you doing, Isaiah's? I'm doing really good. Um, people should know that the conversation you actually want to listen was before that we started recording. Just that. Yeah. You, you were recording yeah. that. You were recording a conversation that's never going to air because we were talking shit about everybody. No, 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 I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Well, maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe. <laughs> all right, all right. So uh, let's start. Let's start. Uh, first of all, let's let's introduce yourself. Uh, uh, what is your name? What do you do? How long you been collecting? Like, like talk to it. Like, what what is your connection with collecting? What are your turn offs? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What is your what is your passion about Carlos and, what, <laughs> and why? Well, my my name's Ignacio. Everybody knows me, Ignacio JIV Hazardous M13 mm -hmm. on uh, Instagram. Uh, hold on, hold on. That's one. Yes, Nacho. 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 Everybody calls me Nacho. Yeah. So uh -huh. if you can't pronounce my name, it's Nelly. Go ahead and call me Nacho. And Nacho, like Nacho Libre. Yeah, yeah. just you. like Nacho Libre. <laughs> Um, I'm a service manager for a tank leasing company, mm -hmm. and uh, well, you know, I like to sell and collect a, a lot of toys. You know, I've been doing it on whatnot since what, maybe like November. Right. Yeah, not, yeah. not that long, not that long. You okay, know so I mean? you're one of the resellers, right? So, well, man, I wouldn't really call myself a reseller oh, because I, lo I, love to I love to collect. <laughs> I'm go, a Yuli collector Junior. first. You know? okay, okay, I love that's, to that's collect. That's fine, but you're a reseller, right? You're <laughs> well, Just admit it. You. Come on, guys. <laughs> like, what, what's so hard I like about? to make money off toys. You know, you know it's, I guess it's it that the, the, I guess the dream. There's some resellers out there that give you a bad taste, so that's why you don't want to be known it. But, I mean, being a reseller is some resellers that yeah, yeah, that are kind of like bad, that are bad, but, I mean, then there's some that you know that are good. They're, they're you know, well you know I like to, I like I like meeting people. You know how you you know you get on the show and you start selling to people. You start meeting a lot of people. Start making a lot of contacts and starting to find some stuff. You know that you've been trying to look for and hunt down. You can make a good contact on there by trying to sell them something. Yeah, and you're easy to get access to. You know that type of stuff. Nice, nice. Like I, I'm. I'm Honestly, and I don't want to make uh, everything about me, but it's kind of like yeah, people, people, people complain to yeah, I attempt to do that, but it's my show, so I have to talk about me. So <laughs> a little bit. No, but but I promise I'm gonna, I'm gonna get back to you. So uh, I recently saw like a bunch of stuff in my collection. I don't consider my wrist I'm, I'm a reseller because a reseller, oh. it's buying something <laughs> with the intention to resell. When I bought it, the intention was collecting, and then it turns out that I wanted to kind of like clean up the, the the collection a little bit, so I started selling. But I've never bought anything with intention to resell. <laughs> but, <laughs> but, hold on, hold on. But now that I kind of like sold some of it, like a lot of the stuff, and then I, hey, hold on, there's like, you know, there's good action. I love the, the helping out people. That's the excuse. Like, oh, I like to help out with people. Nah, you, have, you like to, help, to make money. Make money, yeah. I, I hear with people like, oh, I like to, to help people to, to, to grow their collection. I like to help. You're trying to make it look nice. I mean, nice. I, no, I, it's I, nice, I, I see but, both but at, ways. The, at the it's end of the day, it's business. And then yeah. Yeah, all right. Anyway, so I'm kind of like seeing like things with a different set of eyes, right? Because mm -hmm. now I'm like, oh, man. And a lot of people know why I'm also selling, not only to clean the collection, but I wanted to get into another. Yeah, get other line. lines. But I'm like, now, wait, hold on. I have a, now I have a bank that I can probably put towards like, like, a, like a collection that I can resell and then turn it into a, a hobby that I can also be sustainable for my collection so it's something that I, that you do you said that people would kind of like open up like 
in a way to kind of like sell their collections or how do you get access to that? I feel like that's my biggest fear to become like if I become a collector or if I were to put a store like Carlos though, like I think that's that's very, that's I don't know if it's it right. takes a lot of time, to but do right. that. but to me like I don't I don't I don't the, the part of selling I think it's it's I can do that, but the part of getting the things that people want how do i get my hands on that like yeah. how do you how do you how do you do that like i kind of wanted to to get like honestly i knew you were a reseller but like but the thing about the, i guess you know because uh, you haven't been collecting like the hardcore high-end stuff right right so you kind of came in doing both doing the reselling and and, and collecting mm -hmm. right so yeah. right from the get-go yeah right so that's yeah. what i'm saying uh, how do you how, how do you see it because it took me a little while to, to to kind of do what Yuli's talking about, it, you know, I was more collecting more than anything else. Right. And then, and then a couple, few years later, that's when, you know what, I'm going to start reselling as well. Well, you know, when I started collecting about, what, four years ago, I started really going hard. I started cut, buying a bunch of loose figures. So I started buying a bunch of loose figures and then... And so, what did you learn from that process? That, uh, you know, you then you got to buy all the accessories and that mm -hmm. it ain't complete if you ain't got the card back. You ain't got the card back. You ain't got the comic. <laughs> so, <laughs> so it's probably better to, for me to just buy the damn thing complete. There, there you, you know go, what I mean? There you go. But, uh, you know, it's just a learning process from the beginning and, and you know, doing all that. And uh, on the higher end stuff, you start learning about variants and more, you know, getting more knowledgeable about, mm -hmm. you know, each each line. And so, you know, you start the higher end pieces are like, like the show that I bought from you. Mm -hmm. You mm -hmm. know, you start getting into stuff like that. It's just, it's just expensive. Got to sell some stuff to try to, there you go. to make, gotta... make up to get that. So you start picking up all the, you know, all the loose stuff that I had there. Is try to sell that just to be able to save up and buy something like that. And I think that's what everybody's, everybody, I, well, not everybody. I'm not going to say everybody, but I, I think once you have, when you become a vet in it, that's, that's what you do. Like, that's right. exactly what Yuli's doing. He's, he's more vet now. We can't say that he's a, he's a freshman and doing this. He knows what he's doing now. He has contacts. I mean, once you have contacts, that means that you know you you know, and you're selling right. quick. That's a good thing, man. That that's a good sign that that people respect you. People know you're selling some good stuff, and that's what you want. And that's what we talked about. You know, you, you have some bad sellers out there, and you have some good ones. Right, right, and, right. And so, I mean, I I think you know, you you buying high end stuff. It that that's it's a good thing because the market stays alive. Right. The what, pressure, what, yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What 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 I like to see is when Yuli put his stuff out. Even myself too. And people still like, hey, how much, how much, how much? That's good. That means the the bark is still alive, and that's that's yeah. what I like to see. No, for sure. And I was I was I was honestly impressed because I don't know if I think we are work because man, you sold them on the covers <laughs> quick. I'm like, wow. Yeah, I know. I, I I put I put them on. They were at a good price. I'm not gonna say they were they weren't low, but they weren't high either. They were where they, they needed right to be, and they yeah. sold. And, and no, no, no. There, there. I feel like there was a good price, and then. If people want kind of like bundle, because there was a couple of guys that bought more than one or on their cover, like I would just give them a little bit about a prize or whatever. Uh, but but I still got you know what I put in. I, I'm not gonna say that I made profit because I also bought recently and I bought like during the yeah. pandemic. So I feel like I bought in a pandemic at a good price, so I was able to sell them at a, this point at a fair price. Just to break so even. I, I, so basically, I kind of got what I put in, but still. Uh, I was able to to move them to get into another you know projects. I still don't know if I'm gonna make the deal with 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 the collection that I was offered. I'm still working on that on the details. It might happen. It might not. But honestly, in the in the beginning, I was super hyped. I was super excited about it, and I wanted to grab that collection that moment. If I would have had the money, and of course, I have my limitations and all that. And, and then I, we, I set up a price on my head. I'm like, this is what I'm gonna offer. Mm -hmm. Hopefully, he takes the offer. And in a week, a week and some, I met that. I met all of that, and it's not. It was not small. Yeah, yeah, it's a good amount. And I was like, oh, shoot! Like, it was, I was, I was impressed because even when when I first posted it, I was like, well, I'm gonna try because I didn't want to get ahead of my head. Like, oh, yes, I was like, yeah. oh, I'm gonna try to sell the undercovers. Like, but then they sold like in two days, like in the weekend. Yeah, and then I started pulling quick. more and more stuff. And that's good. that's what I'm saying. That's 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 awesome. Man. And, I, and I thank everybody. You know, I know people that watches the show. No, I mean, yeah, that's right. people that, that watch that, that goes things, a long so way. I appreciate it. everybody. Everybody. Um, let's go back to Ignacio. I feel like, I, yeah, yeah. So, uh, 
How do you what do you what do you consider more like you consider more so more yourself like like a collector or a reseller or or, or, a, or a reseller to to collect or well I'm a collector first I like I like you know jumping on and you know throwing a stream out there and trying to give people some good stuff maybe everybody's you know looking for some and just running it and, you know having fun with them in the chat talking mm -hmm. to everybody meeting new people interacting with people and stuff like that yeah, yeah you know and making up creating, making some yeah. money and then you know creating. saving that being able to either you know make some money back or something that I bought or, you know, just go out and look for some other stuff and try to invest in something else. I think, I think in, 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 in a lot of pl platforms, uh, and I think this is what I like about why not a lot, even though I haven't been there in a while, like because, because first of all, it's super tempting. And right now I'm not, I'm trying to save up for <laughs> this new collection, but, but, um, I feel like what, what the why not community or the app or whatever makes it different is, On eBay, there's not like interaction. direct interaction, right, or, right, right. And, and even with other, you know, show, but but why not? It's live. You're, you yeah. you can you can see or hear the seller, and then you can even hear information. I love when people. I don't know how many you guys sell in why not, and I don't know if anybody else is listening or why not. What I like to hear is like more information about the toy. A lot of people put it up, like a story and stuff about not, it. Not or? necessarily story, but just information about it, because a lot of people put it up thinking that everybody knows what it is. And a lot of times I know what it is, but then a lot of the times I, I if I want to get into a new line and I don't know what's the year and so I want to bid, but I don't know if it is vintage or it's new. Tell me what year. And then by the time that I type, the the, yeah, the clock is running out. So right, but right, at the details the, and all there, that. There's people that that hype it up. That like there's people like Mo to Master. He's like a DJ and hype everybody all but like oh like whoa whoa whoa, whoa. I'm, I'm about to get a seizure here like this is, this is cool man and there's people like you know SC, SC to, uh, to, uh, shout out to SC, 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 to Hunter, SC yeah. to he, he's got like a great great toys and every, yeah, every time he inventory. brings like great figures yeah, inventory he always, he always has a good inventory so, That's why he yeah, good shows. shout out yeah. shout out to, to all those you know but I like when, when the show is entertaining I feel like yes I'm buying but it's also super entertaining it's entertaining yeah so So yeah, how do you how do you run the shows? What is your primary? Do you have a specific day or just kind of like every every now and then? Or well, I like to probably run like once every other month. You know, I like to go out and hunt some stuff, see what I could get, get, get some good inventory in there. Mm. Maybe I could find a big lot if I buy a big lot, get whatever I need from it, and then resell the rest. Or mm. maybe I could jump on some good deals. You know, sometimes you could get some good deals, yeah. uh, and at you know in the in the middle of the night. You know, get Man. those deals. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Are you getting those deals along with Carlos together? Yeah. Yeah. What, what? What's going well, on over I, here? I, you're I, the one feeding me over here. You, I don't know where you guys go to, to get deals. Uh, I know. I'm, I'm, I'm having the, over, the sheets over my head. You guys, you guys going, oh, 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 I was thinking yeah. more. You guys both. I have pictures yours, you know, in an alley, in the middle of an alley, like, getting deals with, you know. Anyways, I don't, I don't know. Um, no, I'm just talking around. Always with these, you know. Yeah, but, we but, like to but, tease. Um, no, I, I, so... In in your perspective, then you're not about what would, would you ever consider buying like a high when you say when we say high in peace would you see yourself buying a a five thousand ten thousand dollar figure would you see yourself doing something like that when um, you're doing something like because that because we're, we're uh, as we <laughs> talked about there's tiers there's levels to collecting right. what what do you would you ever get to that being well, that you, you, I, you have you done I'm not like, saying you're new but at the same yeah. time you know to get there's levels well. Right, there's levels, but man, I think I'm on. Uh, you know what? I've been uh, going back and forth. I'm like, man, I got all these common figures. Maybe I should give you to that and just start collecting like the higher end figures. Mm -hmm. You know, start collecting the higher end figures yeah. and just keep nothing but that. But I can't do it. I need to. I, I, <laughs> then I'm gonna, you know, I gotta go back and get them one day. I'm gonna want to go back and get them. But yeah, I mean, I would, I would. If, I'll, I'll, I'll spend some money for a good figure. You know, I have to look at the condition and all that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know, but yeah, like undercovers are gonna be on my list, for sure. Mm. You know, I, we we well, you know, Paula Shirt had all those yeah. undercovers, and he was giving us good prices. And I don't know, maybe one more of those equis, <laughs> and I would have probably jumped on a couple of them. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you, you had Eddie, 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 Eddie was there too. So Eddie, oh, Eddie, Eddie would have helped. We could have got man. together and picked them up, pero. Yeah, he, he may say he's poor, man, once, but that's, that's you, one guy you but, don't But, you know, I got to be responsible. I mean, I'm thinking about, exactly. okay. Exactly. I was going to say, once, once you get into that. Uh, maybe I should wait because, you know, I have spent, you know, some pretty good amount of money. It, it, but, it, but, it, but, okay, so when you say that, you say that for your collection or are you, t or are you saying because you're going to dig into your actual personal, like, say, like uh, of savings to get. Oh, no, no. Yeah, okay, no, well, I'm not going to do that. Yeah, I, you know, it's going to be from so my it, personal. So it, it would hurt you. Say, for instance, let's say, let's say, um. 
Today you buy you buy a figure for two thousand dollars. Let's just put a number out there. And then another one pops out that you were looking for is for another four thousand or another three thousand. And you have the money to spend. You do have the money. Would you do it, or you, you would you have like, man, I don't know. I just spent this much money. Mm. Let me let me hold on. Well, it depends on how long I've been looking for it, and right. and how long. It, when does it pop up? That that that. Well, I say it's a figure that you want. When do you ever see it pop up? I mean, I'm but, never gonna see what, it. That's then what I'm saying. It's, it's is a, it gonna a, be in this condition? But that's what I'm saying. Is, is it gonna be is, complete? Is, is it gonna be? That's, you know, a, that's that's you. you that's that's the thing. Like one thing is it's 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 for sure in the collecting is that the figures will pop out. Whenever you're the least ready, <laughs> yeah, oh, man. Yeah, yeah. I hate. And that. that's where you got to spend and, the money. And that's like you can have the yeah. money, and then nothing will pop up, and then all of a sudden you have a medical bill or whatever, and then that's then you're running problem. out of, and then you're selling budget, your monito, and then <laughs> boom, the the figure that you need, like, oh man, it was. I mean, but like you said, those type of figures, the the value stays up. Yeah, you know, you know, you, like like I said, you're reselling, you're making all these connections, or you could probably go back and try to sell it and make the money back off of it, you know. Well, I mean, that's the worst that, you, that mean, can happen hopefully. is at least break even. I mean, right. at least break even. Yeah. That's, that's what I'm saying. When, when, you know, when Yuli was selling all these, all this, all this stuff, all his doubles, man, I was like, man, that's badass. I, I, I like to see that. And not so much because, you know, we we're friends, but it's more so that the market's still like People are, like, right, 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 right. I'm going to keep right. saying that, you know. We're, we're, I, we're the last of the dying breed. That's all I can say. You exactly. know, I, I, don't, I, don't see, I don't see our kids doing what we're doing. That's well, the, yeah, well, you know I, what? I feel, I feel like that, and that's that's why. What do you think? Keeps... What do you think about that? Do you think? Do you think it's... Well, I got a son. He's 16 years old, and uh, my son. I'm like, hey, Ignacio, get on there with me and let's do this stream. So you could kind of get used to being live Around and talking Latino, to people, yeah. interacting with people. My son, he got his online friends from school and all that, and they like to play games. But you know, hey, let's go to the toy store. And look at my collection and this and that. Like, no, Dad, you know, you go do your thing, and <laughs> I'm over here. Pero. You go into his room. My son has his own little collection. We we'll don't talk about it too much, but he has his own collection. Okay. And then sometimes I talk, I'll, I'll tell him, hey, you know, all this stuff in here, I'm going to give it to you. You're going to keep it. And you're going to, he's like, yeah, duh, dad. Yeah. So, you know, <laughs> it's in his head. It's just that he's not as like, you know, but I'm sure that later on, you know, it, it's, it's going to. Maybe but later I, on, it but, could be for a sentimental ve- reason. But or, like, yeah, right. like Carlos says, I think, I think we're a dying breed on, 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 the, on the matter. Like, I feel like people will, will, will hold it, will keep it. Out of respect, some of them. I don't think a lot of people maybe mm-hmm. maybe just sell them just for right. cheap, whatever. A lot of people will keep them out of out of sentimental value mm-hmm. because of their dad has them, had yeah. them or whatever. Right, right. But I don't think it's gonna go on. I don't know for how long this. this I mean, gonna... I don't know that you know the turtles have been coming out with more movies. There's more younger people seeing that the mutant yeah, mayhem and all but, that. But, but, but look, look at but the amount of look at, vintage, look at yeah. the amount of no whatever vintage or new. Look at the amount of of figures they do. So. It's hard for them to become rare, right? Because of the amount of figures they do. And, that was, and then they didn't that intentionally back then. It was just the limitations on on the productions, right? So on the, right. on the machines, there was a lot of limitations. So it's not that they were trying to make it all hard to get. No, no, they were trying to get as many as they could. Yeah. But yeah. but the production, it was it was they had they had, they couldn't keep up with, they had with technology. The, with, at that so time. exactly. So so now. Like not a lot of figures survive, and the one last one, like it, it just became a rarity or whatever. Mm-hmm. So I don't think we have that issue now. So I, and I don't even know if if the kids now play that much with 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 figures. That that's what I'm saying. The I times, feel like the new the, changed, the new figures yeah. are made are made for 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 adults. Not for yeah, not for yeah. They, it does seem like they're trying to get it out to more adults. I buy them. Yeah, <laughs> I buy them. There was, there was I some, buy them and I put them a, away uh, from my son. You know, I mm-hmm. put a look like I just keep one in box. Keep one, I'll open it, you know. Yeah, and, uh, they, 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 there was written in an article that uh, a study said that now the adults represent the majority buyers oh, yeah. for action figures and toys. Right. So even new figures. So the study shows like we adults buy more than the kids. Or, or the toys oh, for the yeah. kids. Well, you know, you walk down a toy aisle in Target, you're going to see a father and son, or you're just going to see some grown man in there no. by himself. Well, I, <laughs> that's I, me. I, that, yeah, that's <laughs> me. But that's, that's, what, that's what I'm saying. Like, yeah. the, the figures that, that, that they create now, it's, 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 they're a target to adults. Right. One time, when I started, I, when I was, like, collecting, like, more, like, newer stuff and all that, so I would go to Target. And one of the, like, at least one or two, two times, 
one time the 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 lady on the on the the the, the cashier mm -hmm. she's like oh you have a lot of you know cool stuff for your kid and i'm like Yeah, yeah, for my kid. <laughs> I'm like, it was literally the meme. Like, oh, yeah, yeah, for my kid. I'm like, Ooh, okay. <laughs> and, and, and then another one, it was like even stranger situation. And it was like, why are you mad? Like, aren't you trying to sell this stuff? Because it was uh, me and, uh, um, on, and a friend. And we had like a cart. And then he wanted one. I wanted one. So we kind of like double sell like a lot. And there was a lot of stuff. <laughs> And it looked like we were kind of like scalpers, but we didn't. Kind of. we, we weren't kind like. Of. No, kind no, 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 yeah, yeah. no. Because the no, scalpers were getting like, like four, guys. five, six. It was those guys. Yeah. No, no, no. It was one and one, like one inch. <laughs> yeah. But the lady at Target was like, oh, like, what, what did she say? She was like, ah, oh, aren't like, kind of like, she was trying to, 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 to make us, you know, feel sh like shame or something. Like, leave something for the kids. <laughs> she, she said something like that. Like, leave something like, what? We got this from the collector section, like we, like from that, you know. It didn't say yeah. and all that in the like, back. What the, what the, like what? And, and she, but she was kind of like, my, oh, like leave something for the kids. I'm like, kids don't buy this shit. Like, so, <laughs> and, and recently I was reading that. And article. it does say like 18 and up, right? Anything Neca, yeah. I think it's for adults. Yeah, right? Neca is more for adults. Yeah. yeah. So, so in your in your collection, what does it consist of? Modern, vintage, what? Uh, mostly vintage. I have a mixture. I got some modern in there. I collect a little bit of the origins. The Motu Origins, um, uh, getting into the Dark Turtles, you know, that's a little bit upper in the line then. You try mm -hmm. to get those, but mostly going to be vintage. Vintage, okay. Yeah, mm -hmm. mostly Motu vintage. Um, you know, Motu has a bunch of variants, so I like to collect a bunch of variants, you know, France, and, you know, I got a couple of Leo and Argentina and, you know, stuff like that. Cool, so cool. that's a pain in the ass. Yep, um, it's a bit nice, but it's fun. It's fun trying to hunt them down, but like I said, you know, you gotta meet people like Instagram and all that. See where you can find those type of variants. You know, those rare so, variants uh, because like, they're uh, hard to find. And uh, like, I mentioned this before. You know, a lot of people say, "Man, I wish if I would have known, I would have. If I would have went back in time, I would have. I would have." Now done that it. I mentioned, I have a lot of Argentinian variant for Motu. We'll Fair. talk. We can talk. Yeah. A bit. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I do. I do. <laughs> so so uh, yeah. So you know, but at the same time. We, we, you know, I've said it. Let, let's say, let's say that was true. Everybody go back to their time where they feel okay. I could have got this. I could have got this figure that they're so rare. Would it? Would they be rare now? They yeah. wouldn't because everybody be having them. Right. And they would take. So that's it. I think times the way they are, that's hard to get a piece. I, I'll, I'll, I'll take that over actually yeah. having it because that means if that was the case, then everybody would have it too. Mm -hmm. How often? How often do you do you buy a piece? Ooh, Daily, man. Weekly. Every every other day, well, weekly for sure. How addicted are you? How, that's, that's the real that, question. Yeah, that, hey, that's Carlos, 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 follow my ass. That's, that's, that's Carlos, you're question. getting ahead of you're getting ahead of my question. Well, I mean, let, let I, guess, for a bit of, let I mean, I guess you could say is is it's addicting, right? You know, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a habit. You know, trying to nice to look not, for not way, nice way well, like, to put it. Yeah, like, like I said, like I said, if I see some that I've been looking for and I haven't seen it in a long time, uh, I'm gonna get it. You know, I mean, I'm gonna try try as hard as I can to to get it, and then I'll just I'll just think about the money later. There you, you know? go. Yeah. <laughs> that's, that's a dish. That's my. That's my. That's my. I mean, when you even see that piece pop like up me. again, you gotta you gotta be. Ah, you know, come on, you're really smart about it, guys. You're, you're not. not. Save your money. Yeah, save your money. Talk guys. about the blank. <laughs> talk about the. I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know what you're talking about. Well, yeah, look, look, I'm a well, like I'm a service manager for a tank leasing company, and then I have my own business on the side too, right? Me and my wife, and then so I pay myself in action figures. Right. No, and, okay. Yeah. yeah. All right. Yeah. Um, but it's okay. I just, I just did that job. Hey, what did your wife say? Hey, this, this guy here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. This <laughs> guy here. <laughs> no, yeah. I, I feel, I feel like I'm, I'm, um, coming back to, to, to what I was doing, doing with, the, with all the cleansing and selling and everything. I think I pull out, pull a good bank for figures. And like I said, I don't know if it is. I'm thinking both ways. Like, in the beginning, I was super excited to get this lot. But now I'm thinking of a lot of options if I don't get the lot. Exactly. That's what. That's so what was, that's, now that I have the money, I'm like, there's a lot of options. I said, if the guy agrees with me on my offer, like I'll do it because I already have the money. I did it for that because of that. But if he doesn't, if he doesn't agree with me with the offer, hopefully he does. But if he doesn't, I'm like, I'm left with a huge bank. Mm -hmm. So first of all, it's cool because now I'm gonna have months and months. Well, I can spend it all in a couple of weeks, but. I'm gonna try to stretch it, <laughs> but I, I'm gonna have months of budget, couple of months, to, that I'm not gonna be getting money out of my pocket to mm -hmm. buy. 
but from my bank. So it feels funny or it feels cool. Like, all right, I feel like. And, and, and the thing about that too is, is that you're not buying like crazy no more. So you, you, mm, I'm, you're I'm more selective. Niche. Yeah, yeah, yeah I'm, selective. I'm more, so more niche now, right now. Now, now, and I think, I think with time, I don't know if you're in that stage already, Ignacio, but when, when, when I like, if I buy from my collection, of course, just like you said, it has to be clean. Right. It, you know, it has to be gradable or and super say, rare or rare. That that's what I go for. So you you have your niche. So now you're not just gonna buy a thousand things. Right, right. Oh, you know some some guys. Oh, like it's, what, what, what would you say is your niche? What, what what do you do more? Like turtles, Motu. You mentioned Motu, but turtles. But well, I love Motu. Um, that's your first tur- passion. That was my first one. Yeah, it was or it is. Yeah, yeah. Well, okay. uh, I'm into turtles right now, but Motu is gonna be like my one of my okay, main okay. ones. My mm-hmm. main one. Okay, um, right. And but, why is that? Man, I just I just feel the 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 connection with the nostalgia. He-Man. Oh, okay, yeah. The nostalgia you, with seeing them when I was whenever I see a, a cartoon of, of Motu, it just it just takes me back to when I was little and, and you know growing up at my mom's house, sitting down on the wood floor and just watching Motu and you know just Christmas whenever they yeah. gifted oh, cool. us something like that. So it's 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 something that always takes me back. Okay, okay. Motu does, and you know what well, Motu's he's just he's just a beast. You know, ain't yeah. nobody gonna mess with, with he man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, yeah, you, so. you Carly's a big Motu. Uh, uh, Motu represents what percentage of your collection? Man, I'm gonna say it's about 50-50. Oh, really? Yeah. 50 turtles, 50 Motu. <laughs> no, no. 50 I, got, Motu, I, got, 50 I, got one, I got one whole wall, and then I got another whole wall of turtles. So I got to split the room, split even, and it's all full. Oh wow! Yeah, it's full, and I got some pretty good stuff. Do you do right anything there. besides Motu and and, and uh, turtles? Well, I'm collecting Mumesa. I'm finishing that up. Mm. I like Mumesa. I've been finishing that up. Mm-hmm. I um I got a couple of street sharks. I like I like those street sharks. Um, I like a little bit of mix of everything. You know, I got a. I'm looking for Voltron. Mm. Voltron. I need, to, okay. I need to give me Voltron. I've been hunting for that. Oh, that's one of the lines that a lot of people like, and I don't. Yeah, I don't know much I, about I it. I actually sold all my I, Voltron. I never saw. The, I never saw the yeah. the, the, the cartoon or. Me neither. Uh, so yeah. and I have Voltron. I had Voltron figures, but I sold them. I mean, okay. I just, it wasn't Voltron. I got a little bit of, of um, uh, Ghostbusters and stuff like that, and then I'm, I'm getting into like uh, I'm trying to get this line, but not yet. But I guess Skeleton Warriors. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Like a knockoff Honestly, of. of uh, Mm-hmm. Is it a knockoff? Or the one that has that no, no, they, no. It's actually a toy line. They do oh, have really? a toy, and I think they're cool, man. And they're like underrated. Well, they, which they one is it? Like, because it's called the one that has Pancho Villa. No, that's not. That's, that's, not, Skeleton that's, that's not Skeleton Warriors. That's um, that's the one that. Those I Those are bootlegs. Yeah, I know. I know mm. what you're talking about. But they're expensive. Yeah, yeah they're expensive. Oh, wow. Yeah, they're yeah. expensive. I want to. I want to get into those, but. Skull, skull, film. something. I, I know what you're. I know yeah, exactly those, what you're those, talking those about. The and they're hard to find. They're, they're, uh, no, they're when hard. I heard Pancho Villa, I'm like, oh, yeah, yeah, no, yeah, they're, nice. never they're, heard of it. They're, they're hard to find. They're hard to find complete. And you find, even on Carter, you find them on Carter. They're they're okay, up there. okay, okay. They're like eight hundred bucks. But yeah, yeah, they're they're but they're just it's not a, it's not a big line either. So that's good. So yeah. speaking about that, you know, we talked about the variants and about the Motu. You know, Yuli Yuli does this. He's he's a nerd when it comes to this of, you know, taking pictures and xing out. When it's a big like, like say oh, for battle into, like, yeah, the, the, like do you, are you into? Does it matter to you if you want to collect the whole line, or or just complete, the main, com, 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 completionist? Completionist, yeah, or just just what you like. Oh, man, not really. I made the mistake of buying doubles and triples. And but but like of the like whole, like, so say for are, instance, like the, the like more to. Are you looking to complete the set? Are you completing? To complete? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I, I completed most of it. Yeah, okay. all the main figures, you know, and I got, you know, the scare glows. I need to get the laser power He-Man and mm. uh, stuff like that. So that's where Yeah, the Megator and the Titus. I uh, haven't tried to get those yet. Those are those are big ticket items. Those are like, big yeah. ones. Yeah. <laughs> the Titus and the Megator, yeah. But I want to give me the, the lasers for sure. The lasers? You have Skeletor, right? I got the Skeletor. Yeah. Mm. I was thinking about getting one, but I'm not sure I'm between that one and the Leo. And then I need the to give me one what again. the... See? The and guy that says that he's not. But, but I, the what? The Cobra Khan, the, the like the camouflage. Oh, the camouflage. I want to give me one mm. of those. I can, I can, I can get you one. <laughs> <laughs> for real? For real? Can, yeah, for real. <laughs> I need one. No, <laughs> yeah. It, it, no, I'm, I'm being serious. I know. Yeah. All right. I, I, know, I know there's a few of them too. And I, I actually know where's the Carter uh, one. I, I, I help. I'll help him. I'll help him uh, get what? his. There's a Carter one. Oh, for real? Mm-hmm. Man. There's a Carter one. Where? Mhm. Oh shoot. Yep. That's, and I'm. That's even crazy. Yeah, you're you're, you're thinking on it. Yeah, 
You're gonna sell it because you're you're you're, you're gonna be complaining like oh, I won't be able to sleep if the if the robber pops out. Like, you're gonna sell well, it. You know what? You, you had a Leo yeah, yeah, you're Skeletor right. and sold it. I'm like, oh yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. You told me about that. You know what? You're absolutely right. I, 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 don't, I believe it's, you will buy it, but it's scary. It, it, I believe you you'll buy it, but I think you're gonna sell it like right away. I want to sell it right away, but but I think I mean that is the, with the pre pressure. I want to I'm gonna be telling like, did they break now? Is, oh. it, is it broken now? Shut up. Did it break? Shut now? Up, I'm gonna be telling you, you gotta sell it right away. Yeah, that, that man, that's scary, man. <laughs> that's what that's, we're friends for. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, um, <laughs> that's cool, man. That's cool. So, guys, one question. Um, when you sell mostly the the, the, the the most amount of of lines that you sell are the ones that you most collect like for example Ignacio you sell a lot of Motu and and, and TMT or, or well I sell mostly TMT right now I don't really get into my Motu stuff <laughs> and try to sell it because right now man I just don't see the the, the worth of me trying I'm gonna to start requesting Motu on the stream now yeah mm -hmm. no yeah <laughs> man, no yeah no you can do that but I, I sell mostly TMT you know, so you think yeah. that sells quicker or what? Yeah, I mean the Motu is just it just it just but the prices are kind of down, and I'm no. But at keep the same them. time, if you think about it, and this is this is something that I think I I, I don't even what not cut on, but you remember how they used to be streams just for turtles and streams just for the, they don't have that anymore. No it's all action. They moved, yeah, yeah, they moved. Yeah. So so and that's how it used to be back in the days. I mean, so I I think the crowd that you have is is mainly tur turtles, turtles, and that's what I was telling Yuli. You know, I'm tr I'm trying to get out of I that th where it's just I turtles. I'm I trying think to get the more into more right. the more into crowd. Variety. I mean, because I go and get on those streets with different think, stuff. I don't think the prices on the motu are down. Uh my uh, hopefully I'm not offending anybody. I just think the motu crowd is a little bit older for the app, and I think oh, that yeah. the turtles, think about it, that's yeah, right, turtles, right, right, turtles right. is more like. More that, that, that is, that is a good so, assessment there, Because yeah. I, I know for a fact that Motu still moves up like in, 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 Mo, big, Mo, in yeah, big prices expensive. right now. Like I don't think is is that. If anything, on the higher end, like there's big time collectors that will just move Leo figures, Top Toys figures, like right. the, the the high end, and they will still move up. It's just they just do mo don't move in the same room but, as turtles. The crowd is different. The crowd is younger. Tim and T, Motu. I don't think like the, the hardcore Motu collectors, they're not in <coughs> on one. Not, like that. That's my right, have, right, right. Do you have, right. A, do you, have you have Facebook, right? I th uh, well, uh, well, no, my wife does, and I get on there. I try so to search if, stuff. So if, like if you were to go on Facebook, man, for when it comes to Star Wars, because Star Wars is almost the same thing too. And he's absolutely and right. If you Star think about Wars, it, Star yeah. Wars is it's older, older crowd. Older mm -hmm. crowd, will, and we'll go more into Facebook. So you you'll find Facebook, Star Wars. If you want to hardcore sell, people, people yeah. on Star Wars on Facebook, Mo too. Of course, turtles too. Turtles too. But 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 yeah. But that that I think that's a good assessment there. What you just said because I I, I didn't think about it like that. No, yeah. you don't. You don't, remember, you don't see hardcore you, you'll collectors. Find, you'll find some guys looking for. Mo, I'll be a guy looking for Mo too. But so. but, mm -hmm. but why? What is people looking for Mo too? They're like regular figures, uh, like. You More put common, up, a, you yeah. put a variant there. It might go up, but it's not gonna go for for what it really sells for, like. And, that, right. and it's it's taking a risk. So so that so that be those cases. So bring that up. Do you still do you see yourself just selling on whatnot, or do you try to sell on Instagram or other platforms? Well, I don't. I don't really. I mean, I do it. Like I said, I, whenever I, I I try to, it's just it's just mostly for fun. You know, make a little bit of money on the app mm -hmm. and get out there and just interact with people and. You know, really just have fun and, and, you know, mess around or whatever in the chat. And, you know, but really with with, with the business and, and work, you know, I stay real busy doing all that type of stuff. Mm -hmm. yeah. So it I takes mean, time, yeah. I, sometimes I do think about maybe I should put some stuff up on Instagram and, you know, but I just think about it. But well, let me, man, okay, so I, I never do. My, my experience is like I was Carlos and some people, some other people told me, why do you when I had all everything like right now, I don't have anything. People keep asking me, oh, would you sell this? Like, no, 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 I'm. I'm I'm literally, I just have a few figures for selling. That's it. Like that's, uh, I sold everything that I needed to sell. But before that, Carlos will tell me like, why don't you, you know, set up a, a, a one, at, you know, as a seller. And I was thinking about it, but I was like, no, nah, I don't know, whatever. Once I put it up, once I did this on Instagram, and I did both Instagram and Facebook. I don't think I would do ever like a one at a couple. for me. Mm. I feel like it worked out well mm -hmm. for me on Instagram. That oh, why would I pay? A, why would I pay a fee on on an app or eBay? Like, not saying that is 
you know, if it works for you and then you still make your profit and yeah, all that, that's great. Mm -hmm. But but for me, like, and again, forever grateful to everybody who purchased, if you are watching me, so thank you so much. But, and I, and I know you all got a deal. Like, I, 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 you guys, you know, but but I, I wouldn't see myself, like, giving out deals and then taking out well, of well, so, the so, fee. So, I feel like I'd rather give out the deal to the guys instead of taking the, the fee. Yeah, so it. so that's kind of what I've been told as well is why don't you run a whatnot? Because I mean I don't do whatnots as often, mm -hmm. and, and when I first started, right. I don't do them as often. And I think you know people know that they don't. I don't run too often because I sell more so on on Instagram. Mm -hmm. Facebook is not my thing. I've done some Facebook. I don't get too many, you know. I don't get too much feedback. But when it comes to Instagram, it's a lot quicker for me to sell. Right. And honestly, it's just cutting the middle, man. Now at the same time, I think about it. People that people sell on one are going to try to sell as for as high as they can because of course they're going to have to pay the fees. Right. So I, I always think about the fees. You know, I, I I think about that. So I think it's just best just to go. It's quicker. The money comes to you quicker. However you want to see it. But at the end of the day, you can still make and you could do you could give people a good deal. You don't have to be like, well, you know, it's because I'm selling and on the eBay. Fees and all that I gotta stuff. do the just yeah, straight. Yeah. And I understand like eBay sellers. Why the hell do they do it? Like if you're trying to tell them, hey, we could do it outside of eBay. I could still pay you. I pay you in PayPal. Nah, they want to stay in pay and, and eBay like I don't but get the it. But they eBay, they eBay, sometimes the eBay sellers, uh, not only the average, but but a lot of eBay sellers, they don't have Instagram. They're older people. No, but uh, what I, what I'm getting and at they is they're, they're scared of you know probably people trying to scam them. And that's what I'm saying. And but if, like, if you talk to them, they're probably with the PayPal. protection on there just in case something happens. They don't. They don't. Yeah. I mean, but I I mean, like I said, like whenever you do sell, uh, you know, meet new people. Like I said, if you're selling, you start meeting new connections and stuff like that. I mean, you build that trust. Mm -hmm. And you're able to trust people and be able to set them like y'all do on Instagram. Or, but let me ask you. Or, so let me. Okay, let me ask you this. And since you want, because I mean, we both know the world of whatnot. When you're known as as a as a dollar start, you like to do dollar starts, right? Because right. that's pretty much what you do. And I've seen this happen. Guys are expecting to get not not to get a good deal, but they're trying to like get a really good deal where you. And so, yeah. And so there's times that I've that I've tried. I've tried this out as well. And 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 there's times that it's worked. You know, this piece. Let's say, for instance, this shredder. This shredder there's no way I'm gonna start that at a dollar. No, I, I've had start. I've started. I started under covers for a dollar. I started things like that for a dollar because it wasn't really gonna hurt me. But harder, harder pieces to me would be like a euro shredder, a uh, right. complete one. Okay, so guys like start at a dollar. Like I'm not gonna start at a dollar. Yeah, no, you want to well, promote you gotta be it. You have to promote it the hell out of it, and right. they're like, and just but, gonna but take even, even, even then, even then. You know, you might have a guy that might pop in, but then you say, okay, if I run it on whatnot for what I what I actually want to get out of it, I have to go higher because I have to pay the fees. Mm -hmm. And so that that that's I think about all that, and honestly, I've been I've been a little bit more successful at the store, but more so on Instagram on the higher end pieces. Right, right, right. Yeah, and, I would never run a piece like that uh, on uh, well, you, on whatnot. You could for sure. if you could. If you I mean, I'd money, offer you. You know, hit me up, but. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> we ain't gonna do it on there for especially. I, I've not heard, for I've heard people doing because people have asked me, and I'm not gonna say names, but they reached out to me, asking me to to run it up for them to beat up, or run and run the figures up. I'm like, oh yeah, 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 whatever. Like, dude, that's that's, that's and I've seen people well, doing that, like people that don't buy things, but they'll just run it until they want you to run. Yeah, they they, they ask you to run it up for them, and that that's what I'm saying. So. That that's where I feel, and I've I've seen it happen. I have seen it happen where I see people run stuff up, and they never win. They're they're just, they're, you know, they're just. Mm -hmm. uh, I've, just I've, I've been I've been there whenever I try to buy something. I see somebody trying to bid me up, and they'll bid me up, and I mean, that that's okay. I mean, you want to play games? Well, let's let's go for it. I mean, I know yeah. my limit. You know mm -hmm. what I mean. But at the end of the day, but I mean, but yeah, but that's I what mean, I, I, I. I'll take it up to you. I mean, I'll probably stop bidding, and you're gonna have to buy it. <laughs> you know, like yeah. get it up there. <laughs> but it, it, it just and it's usually one of the mods or m the moderators and like they're trying to it's so obvious sometimes like well, anyways yeah yeah I've, um, I've seen, I've, like I said I've seen that so I mean what not to me honestly I like to interact more so I mean I'll sell here and there I don't even know when's the last time I sold I've probably been more than a, or ran a stream probably been like a month two months maybe two months already mm. three months but it, it's not like oh man I gotta sell I gotta sell to make some an extra buck now nah, if, if I need to make an extra buck I mean either I promote the store or I do it on my mm -hmm. Instagram and you know nine times out of ten I, I I'll I'll make a hit you know and I, I, that's that's what I like to do but there's people that tell me man you should keep running or 
why aren't you running? And like, it's not that I don't want to run. It's just, I mean, eh, like mm. doing all that time. I got, I got to put it all in because I like to be. When I, I don't know if you have, you've been in my street, but when I run, I like to put everything in, have everything ready to go. Yeah, I'm it's not, I'm not taking, pic, I'm not taking pictures. It's a lot of work. That's the way I like to do it. It is a lot of work. It is yeah. a lot of work, especially when you got like over 40, 50. But stuff. some, some guys don't mind, and it's fine. Like I said, it's not a problem. People will let me take a picture, and they start typing it as, as the stream is going. To me, it just kind of yeah. takes a little long. Well, you're gonna lose a couple of people when you're doing that. Exactly. You know what I mean? I mean, so it's a, it's a, it's, they're gonna it's, start it's jumping a, in and out of the stream. So, um. So, what is the next? I would say step on 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 your like like your collectors live or whatever. How do you know how to Man, call it? I don't Jerry, know. Is it, like, is it a new line? Is it a new figure? Uh, you, do you display? Like, is it what what would well, be what would be your next level? Your next step? Where would you say like, all right, I'm looking to this new achievement to to unlock. Well, I just got a lot. I got my. Uh, I just got permission. <laughs> to go start throwing stuff and put it running into into the loft because the room that I have is already full. So I want to go into the loft. I'm going to start <laughs> buying, you know, just like shelves like this, start setting that up. And then I'm in like, you know, it's just you buy them loose. Then you, you buy them loose complete. Then you buy them on card. Well, then you start <laughs> within, uh, you know, I had a, you know, when we had the been, Texas and Been there, done that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, we had a Fonzarelli and Raul and all them came down. Right. Mm -hmm. So, you know, we, they start buying a bunch of graded pieces. So I, I picked up a graded piece here. I picked up a graded piece there. <laughs> yeah. And they, now I'm in my room and I'm like, man, damn, I got that pieces, on card. Huh? But you know what? It'd probably be better if I got it graded. So, oh, like, oh. so now I'm like right there. Like, oh, man, I got to be careful, too, because. So do you want to, like, pick the best pieces or, or just trying to grade your figures? <sighs> want to give me a nice pick up, a nice graded. Do you want to pick them? Let's say do I want to pick me them like, up or you want to grade them yourself? Man, I'd rather just go. If I find it in a good price, I'd probably buy yeah. it. Yeah. I mean, that's I, the, I would do that, but uh, based on, like, I didn't do it because of the money I sort of got. And I didn't want to sell them, but the guy wanted to buy them. And they were like, all right. So a good friend uh, of mine, we did a trade, and then he wanted uh, some, some hardcore, hardcore pieces that I graded myself. And I feel like it was a huge deal. It was a huge sell with a huge trade. Uh, but I think he got benefit. Like we, we were, we both were like, like even doubt, even doubt because he got the piece that he traded me a long time ago and he got it for a lot less than, than we, we valued it today, but I also got, you know, the benefit of, I graded the figures by myself and they, they all came <coughs> up 80, 80 plus 85. I'm like, and that, that made me, you know, kind of mm. like recover or make, make make it make it worth or whatever you want to call it so i was like i don't i don't want to grade to to resell or, or sell because i really really didn't want to sell them but man oh man it kind of it helped me a lot when it, when it when it came to 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 trade uh so if you like grade you like do you see do you, do you see doing it like to to increase the value or I mean, yeah, I'm gonna probably gonna it's gonna be doing it to increase the value. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's gonna have to be to increase the value. To, to, okay, okay, okay. So a lot of people, a lot of people don't like that fact that well, people. Well, also pre preserve. I don't care. I, I prefer, I prefer yeah, the people, preserve. Yeah, yeah preserve, preserve it the way but, it's displayed but, and but all okay, that. But, but this is something that we talked about as well, and this is something that to think about. You know, we don't as as we talked about. We don't know if that piece is gonna be valued at the same price. 20 years from now right. because what if like i said we're the last of the dying breed so don't i'm not gonna i'm, I'm not trying to scare anybody you know because I'm, I'm in the same boat i'm in the same boat yeah you gotta pay we're, for it we're, we're, we're paying high end we're paying for high end stuff okay mm -hmm. you know but what if 10 years from now 20 years from now let's say 20 years because 10 years is a little too soon but 20 years from now 30 years from now it's not valued the same because nobody sees it that way mm. the market the, you're, oh, you're the, never, the market the market is not the same so if we're gonna collect, uh, collect for the passion, collect because it makes you happy. Yes, uh, uh, of course. If you gotta resell, it's resell in the in the current market. Yeah, value. you need you need you pretty much gotta keep flipping it. Right. If you're gonna grab resell, it, like it, grab it, flip it. Because like, I I don't think it's a good long term. My perspective, I don't think it's a, a good long term investment because you never know if it's gonna go up or down. Like it's just a coin in the air. Like, but um. But yeah, like I don't know, the grading is it's 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 nice to preserve. 
it's nice to display. I personally, I've been very vocal about it. I don't, I don't really like loose figures graded. Mm -hmm. uh, there's very few exceptions. If I'm gonna grade, I will grade something that is in cart, on cart. But, um, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, it definitely pushes the value of your collection up. But why does that matter? Like, if you're not thinking on on selling, like, especially that, if like, let's right. say you you're I mean, great, no, you're great like, Mo too. I mean, but you don't want to sell me, Mo You're too. gambling. No, but me personally, you do. You said for for money more. I do it because I like the aesthetics. I like the looks of it. Yeah, I like the way it looks, and uh, you that, know, that's, uh, a, that's a few. The that, money that, of it is gonna be a plus. I mean, you know, it's, it means like any other thing. I mean. Uh, Whenever you want to invest in someone, well, you're also thinking about, well, if I'm going to invest in it, I mean, I'm going to be able to get a return on it later on. Mm -hmm. or, or, you know, it don't make no sense to do it. So, But then, but you see, but it you, looks you, nice. You're, you're, you you're, might get some money, a little bit more money out of it later on. But if you so, see, if you, you know, say, I'm, I'm on that. I, yeah, exactly. But the way that you're saying it, that like you're saying, like, if I'm going to invest in it. So you immediately, the moment you said, I'm investing in it, mm -hmm. it means like you're thinking of, on, on selling it because an investment is, is, is looking for a return. Otherwise, the way that I am, like, I know, I know, I just sold a bunch of figures, but I, whatever. But the, the things that I have, I don't see myself selling, like, my collection anytime soon. Right. If I had to move to a smaller house or a smaller display, maybe I have to cramp it down. Maybe I have to, and if it's not going to fit the display, I will sell some stuff, but, but I don't see myself selling my, my collection. So I don't see it as an investment. If I will think, like, then, okay, it's an investment, and, like, I don't see it as an investment. Well, well look, it... it I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna agree to that 100 percent because he could see it as an investment. He could, he could still be an investment to him 20 years from now. He probably won't get what he's looking for. It. That's that's just what it is. That, but right. that doesn't that doesn't mean that he can't sell it. It's, then that's, then that's, it's not. You don't invest to lose. It, some people do. It's a gamble. No, nah, no, nah, nah. Some people. I'm, 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 nah, I'm not saying you, I'm, you, you, you invest not, and you then you lose. lose. No, lose. Yeah, no, no, no. You invest the and then you <laughs> lose. No, it's, it's just but like nobody invests to lose. No, that's what I'm saying. But that's so when you get to like Bitcoin or whatever the hell you want to talk about, when you get investments, some people lose, but you're not expecting that to happen. That's that's no, what I'm exactly, getting at. So you're not you're not you're not investing to lose, of course. But you know he may he may think you know what these guys are talking out their ass. They're saying that it might not be worth. Nah. No, I'm just saying a thousand bucks and. 20 years from now. That, you never know. Like, exactly. You never know because we, we're, we're, we are even seeing that recently. Things that sold super exp expensive in, like during the pandemic or whatever, two years ago, one year, like not too long ago, mm -hmm. they're going way under the value of that. Like, and we can see that. Like, the, I think the most volatile market from the past three years has been TMNT. It goes up and then it goes down and then it goes up again and then you see the black belt super expensive and then all of a sudden you see a guy trying to sell them and they don't sell and then they move up again and then they they I'm like I've seen I've seen, I've seen a couple yeah. of guys trying to sell it and then they, they, they don't they don't move and then all of a sudden they start moving again so I think it's very inconsistent that's why I call it volatile I don't even know is that the right word or like am I saying right. it right mm -hmm. but uh but uh. Well, it's just that's why. That's why. That's all. Because that's why I'm saying, I don't see it as an investment. Because if you to like, I will see like if you're gonna buy a property like a, a real estate. Okay, that's an investment. You get a return if you're rented, and then most likely it's not going to come down. Like so, you the, see it more as a gamble. Buy more because, toys. For me, it's a hobby. Rent. I don't. I don't. I don't see it. <clears throat> like I don't see the money side of it. I have to see it because I have to spend it. But if you see this as a gamble, if you see it as an investment, if you're seeing a return, you're hoping for a return. Okay, I did get a return this time, and then that's okay. what I'm saying. But that's you did. But, but but I didn't buy it to sell them. When I when I I'm like, all right. I'm but happy. You but you still sold them at a good yeah, time. Yeah, and, and I'm happy. And I'm happy to to. But but I could have just not. And I was and I'm uh, now. Okay, so hold on. I got I got what I put in on, on the higher end pieces, and I was happy. But but even on, on a few of them, I lost money, and then because you chose to lose the money. I did. That's I didn't, didn't want to have him sit. Like I, I didn't want to. That's what they. Because you chose for that to happen. Yes. I mean, that's so. I didn't want to be like. No, that's that's. I know what you mean. But, but, but you, but you yeah, can't say you, you cannot say that that you chose. I I I, you lost I, I made because, money on some. Mm -hmm. I lose some on some. So I, I think I broke even. Uh, and we said that's the worst. But on the newer that, stuff, that's, that's the best thing you could come out. If not the worst, that's the best thing. If any, if anything, if you at least break even, at least that. The, the worst thing you could do is, let's like, say, okay. But I was super happy, and even if I lose some money, I'm happy at this point. That's why, that's why I say I don't consider myself, like, 
all jokes aside, I don't see this is what I did as a wrestler because a wrestler would have hold on the figure until he got the 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 the, the profit. He would have tried to make money. I was just trying mm. to literally take it all. And that, that, I, I I did it a little bit more. Like I started like it was a little bit more over 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 a week, but I wanted to to cleanse the collection like. And that's why people laugh like, oh, no, you're trying to make money. I, 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 I also was trying to get some money to, to get into the other collection. But I was like, I was so relieved. Today I shipped like the last, you know, big mm. boxes. I still have a few pieces, but very, very few pieces. Uh, and I'm like super like, I feel like relief. But I never saw that as a, uh, that, uh, let me go back to the, to the subject. I don't, I don't see my as a because I don't think I was looking for a profit. I was just trying to cleanse my my, my, my my collection. If I can get money out of it, that's great. So I see the rest of my collection like that. Like I don't see this as a money on everything. I, I have to I have to put a, a money figure on each one because that's what it cost me. <coughs> but it's not because I'm trying to get more money. So I don't see it as an investment, as a uh, gamble. But whenever, I, I, you know, I, I, I'm 50 50 on that, Yulia. I get what you're coming from. But at the end of the day, if somebody that doesn't know you, somebody's going to say he's, he's a reseller because he sold stuff. I mean, that's just what it is. At the end of the day, I mean, I, it's a good I, feeling when you're able to, you know, say you spent this much money on, on your collection and then one day, oh, I need some money. Let me go just start pulling some stuff out and it just start selling like that. Yeah. You start making money back, even if you break even. I mean, you're making. You're you're I mean you're able to sell it you know and mm. it's just you know you're able to go in there. But of course, he, and what he's saying, and money. I get what he's saying as a re, as an actual reseller, you hold on to something for five years until you actually sell it for what you want to sell. And that there's people. That so are like that's that. why I don't see myself no, as but, a reseller. No, but, but, I see myself as a collector, but cleansing people, the collection. But, but then there's people like Ignacio. That's it. I'm okay. He's a reseller and he's okay if, as long as he breaks even. I'm okay with that. It doesn't mean that I'm gonna be doing that all the time, but I'll be okay with that too. Mm-hmm. I mean, that's that's what I'm saying. Every, everybody's gonna see it differently, but at the end of the day, no matter what, you still resold a lot of things, and that's okay. It doesn't make you a bad per- like you make no, you seem like a bad person. I'm a collector I, I first. Know. I'm, st- I'm still you, gonna, yeah. I'm not gonna I'm accept a collector first. Would you say yes? You're, I love you're my looking collection. More, I you're, think, you're, you're looking I mean, more headstrong. So, what you tell? What do you think? Would you have the same uh, opinion with cars? Cars are not an investment for sure. It could be. If the market goes down, then then uh, use use cars go goes up and maybe maybe you get a profit. That's that, that's a that, okay. That's so a, so, that's so but would you have the same opinion if there are cars? Yeah, because here's the deal. Look, I'm gonna tell you like this. As soon as you purchase a car, let's say you buy a brand new car from a lot. As soon as you drive it out, the value of that car already went down. Mm-hmm. Brand new. Am I right or am I wrong? Because mm-hmm. let's just they, they'll tell you, okay, we'll give you what thirty days, or if you don't like it, we'll just give you your money back. If if, if they do that, but Nine times out of ten, when you, as soon as you drive it out the lot, it's not worth what you think it's worth. Because let's say you want to, let's say in, in 90 days, you know what? I'm not happy with the car. Well, your 90 days were up. You, you're going to have to go resell it somewhere else because you're going to try to find who could give you the, the best money, but you lost on it. Yeah, you already lost. It's not going to be yeah, a brand so, new so car. That's, that's what I'm telling you. That, so the whole, of course, the whole gist of it is as a reseller, you would, you would want to make profit off of it. But it doesn't have... And it doesn't happen all the time. It is not going to happen. There's times that as a reseller, I could tell you this from one night, from my experience, I've lost. But then I broke even or I made more on this other piece that I think of. So, I, you know what? That satisfies me. I'm okay mm. now. And that's what I'm getting at is at the end of the day, at, even if you're not, you don't want to associate as a reseller, which not, is not a bad thing because it, it's not. If, if you are a car collector and then you, have, then you need money and you sell cars, are you a car dealer? If you're a car collector, and you, you yeah, you have six cars, you well, sold I'm, two. I, I, I think that's three. a little different because ah. don't you, no, 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 I'm, 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 no, 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 no. I'm, I'm, the reason why I'm saying this is because don't you have to have like a permit to do all that? Don't, like, I'm yeah. just, I'm, and you also have to have a permit to to, to if you, if you well, call, yeah, yeah, if, if you want to call, yeah, yeah, if you want to call, own if you, <laughs> if you want he, he, is, is he, no, whatever no. he's faced with that, with a real question, like, no, no, he says, I'm glad that we put no, up a mic no, on you. No, 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 let me finish. Nah, it, it, you no, are, if, if you're if, a car dealer, if you're not, sign, yeah, yeah. If, if I'm selling, if I have multiple cars and I'm selling them, I'll, I'll, if I want to be a car dealer, I'll be a car dealer. I don't care. What's so bad about that? <laughs> well, it, you're, you're, you're right on the permit thing. If you, if you own like more than three but or that, four that, cars, you but, need but, to but have a But if you want, if you want to use that as, as, as a, as an example, I'll be a car dealer. I don't care if I have five cars and I'm selling all of my five cars. I'm a car dealer. Then I will. I mean, what's what's the problem with that? I don't I don't get it. 
What, what, was, what was the question behind that? <laughs> I don't understand. No, I, I want to say with the first, with the first reaction. <laughs> the first reaction. Now he fix it up. And, oh, they, oh, yeah, I'm a no, that's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> no, like, but in the beginning he says, oh, no, well, that's different. Uh, yeah, you, whatever. But, but Mr. You say, yes, say, I understand why you said that. No, yeah, he's, yeah, just yeah, to, yeah. he's just oh, trying okay, to be okay. nice with you. Man. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> okay, guys, one question. Um, do you have to know everything about a line to be a good seller on it? It's to be a, okay, you, you you said it to be a good seller. Yeah. That's what I was saying. Like a lot of people put up stuff and why not? And like, what year is it? I don't know. And then everybody's like, I don't know. To be a good, you can be a seller or you can be a good seller. A good seller will tell you, like I will I will say Carlos uh, could be a good seller because he can explain everything that he knows about the figure. Uh, uh, or, or or Raúl El Pelón. I don't know. Yeah, a lot of people knows him. Uh, he he will explain you to you like oh this is this is that is mm -hmm. that year is you know this is rare this is not so that could be a good sell. if you know more about the line it makes you a good seller it makes you, you confident and the people can be confident to know that you know what you're talking about because if you're just oh yeah you know uh, this is rare and, and there's, everything is rare oh, yeah, yeah one of my yeah. things is always trying to find out the COO what's the COO on it like what is it I mean where's it from where's it made or mm -hmm. that's one of my main things you know and then asking for it but. By the time I, I, the question gets out to they even read it, it's already sold. Yeah. You know what I mean? So I, I, That's annoying, man. I hate that. And then, you know, whenever they do don't... post something on online, they say somebody Sh posts Sh them, hey, shout they'll out show to, a picture of the shout, bank. Shout out to TMT Webster that never reads his goddamn chat. <laughs> he never reads his damn chat, man. Come on, shout Webster. Shout out to, uh, how, 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 yeah, it's not Webster. <laughs> <laughs> nah, he's a cool guy. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He gives no. out a really good, yeah. He just don't read the chats. Oh, yeah. he's ignoring everybody. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He don't read them chats, man. He's, he's that famous. <laughs> yeah. He's yeah. that famous, man. Oh, he, come on. He reached that level. Yeah, he's, he's in that level, man. He's too good for us now. <laughs> nah, which is all, all, all shout I mean, out to let's, Webster. Let's do something. Let's go a little bit more specific. Ignacio, what's the the line you know the most about? Let's say. Well, I would say Motu and Team MT is gonna be the ones that I really try to get into. I don't know everything, but you know, I try to do research research on them. How, how do and you do research? What do you do to do research? Do you read books? Do you go to? I'll try to read, you know, go online and read, read up on okay, it. Cool, I'll cool. go follow like uh, big collectors and, uh, you know, and try to get some some info off of, off of there. Because usually, whenever they'll explain some stuff, cool. like you know, like the older crowd, like yeah, you're saying, yeah. and and they'll put some good details on there, and you're able to look for it. You know, we're talking about like paint on the boots, uh, short straps half painted boots or just the top of the rim painted mm -hmm. on a on a he-man or savage yeah stuff like that it's just wild you got to be careful and watch out for that different types of arms different type of legs on a skeletal <laughs> figure yeah you know it's just it gets out of control man but but you need to know little, that knowledge but because fun, you see man. A, i don't know like, all, 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 right? all the all the details all the little details will make up a difference whether they buy the hey, guy look, buys look, it or i not. mean they're taking the look, arms look off got a battle kit yeah oh i know man that's he did to the. I he, want that. He did that. He did that to a friend, man. Was, oh, <laughs> be, yeah. Be careful, guys. Be careful. You know, whenever I first started collecting, you move know, this, I, this over. Yeah, yeah. Bit. Get that away from him. Get that away from him. <laughs> whenever I first started collecting, you know, I was like, I would see all these big collectors, and they had, you know, he man carded or all, all these types of crazy figures. You know, like man, I'll never be able to own that. Hey, you said, man, look at these oh, assholes, man, and you look at you. <laughs> <laughs> That's badass. I'll never be able to get that. And man, I got me a, a He Man card in there. I got lucky on that. Got me that. And it just starts. But, but it's, you know, it's, it's reachable, man. Building up. So, some, 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 people, some people comes. say, like, some people think, oh, I don't have them. I'm like, man, it's reachable. It, it could happen. The man, Euros. The Euros. The Euros are, are nice, nice figures of weapons and all that. And mm -hmm. it's, you know how they have the arms glued and, and yeah. stuff like that? You got to look for all that. Um, I never thought I'd be able to. Um, I'm like man, I'm never gonna be able to get a damn euro shredder, especially mm -hmm, complete. Yeah. Now you need the one on car. <laughs> well, slow down, slow down. <laughs> <laughs> I think we all need that <laughs> one. see, <laughs> but can see homie. <laughs> but yeah, I got, I like I said, you know, selling you meet people and you know, well, I gotta stay. Raul help me get that line. Bro, for, Raul, for a little bit, Raul became a little, a little. Uh, oh a man, plug he helped me Euros, out big time. Yeah. He helped me, help yeah. me. Shout like, out to Raul, like this, like shout you know, out to Gilo. Like, yeah, shout out to Gilo, uh, Raul, Fonzarelli, and it's the crack of black. All the people out there and whatnot. <laughs> all the good people. All the good people out there <laughs> and whatnot. Except, except the. Anyway. <laughs> SC Toy Hunter. There you go. Um, all right. But yeah, man, he no. helped me out a lot. You know, meet a lot of people on there, and they help you complete your collections and. Um, it's just fun. 
Yeah, it, like I said, it, it, it becomes a, a, a tight-knit group where everybody helps one another out. I mean, I mean that's what it's about for, for me, you know. I go out there and I saw and I want to meet people and, you know, and just, you know, just that's, have that's, fun. Collect. And, and that's what I'm saying. So, for instance, like, you know, that's why I always said that I don't, I don't mind helping people, you know, when they ask questions. You know, we talked we talk with Ariel and Ariel said he don't really like doing that. And, and he has his reasons, and I understand, because then they hold you accountable. And I, yeah, and I, I, I never, I, I've never seen that side of the story until a uh, good friend of ours, Ariel. Yeah, he explained uh, that to And, it, and it made sense. It did make sense. I'm like, man, like they hold him accountable, and they're going to be like, well, well, you told me this. So, yeah, I mean, well, I'd rather just stay quiet. Right, and then answer the questions, and and now Carlos is is is, yeah, I, is, I try to, is I, refusing. Now Carlos I try to is do refusing. that. I try to do that, but you like, eh, whatever. Yeah, just yeah, yeah. It's, yeah like it's, pricing, it's, not, it's not my figure. Yeah, like <laughs> pr- pr- pricing things out, or you know, having some knowledge. You know, I try to correct if I can. If I know about it, then I'll be like, hey, look, look for this, or mm-hmm. you know. So I, I don't mind doing that. Why? Because I want it to be. I want the person that's starting to get into the collection and collecting mm-hmm. to be to know what they're doing for one. At least have some kind of idea. Well, and they're not they're not gonna feel like man i I'm, i just got into collecting and i got screwed i'm I'm gonna get out of this right so the more you help the more knowledge you know you, you try to give out the better it is too because it helps the other person when they're starting to collect reach reach a goal like you said get getting getting from high end from you know common to starting to get high end right. and then from there they could start they start just, walking it up yeah, yeah. I mean, I, i've seen it happen i've seen it happen with a couple of guys where you know they ended up from getting a common figure and all of a sudden they have scratch in their hand they have i mean it happens yeah, i've yeah, seen it give me one of those but i mean there's so many other figures that i'd rather buy instead of the scratch right now so yeah this is where you want to put your budget like mm-hmm. and it happens to all of us you know you have you either buy one figure or you buy three like right exactly mm-hmm. and finish something up and that was the know? number one thing like you said the number one thing i always told everybody is, i know it's going to cost a little bit more but it's always best to get it complete yeah, because man, them accessories accessories are expensive. Caught. That's no joke. Yep, <laughs> that's not. Like, no, they're man, not. That's wow. It's crazy how mm-hmm. how sometimes people. How people I was talking. Work? I was talking today. Today with a friend. He just came over and visited. He knows nothing about <laughs> figures or collecting. He was just. He's just a friend from complete different environment. And I was just t- telling him, uh, like, he was, you know, always typical friend, like, oh. I'm about to drop it. I'm about to. I'm gonna tear this off, and I was. Uh, he was holding uh, one of the boxes, and he was like, oh, I'll rip it off. I'll rip it off. <laughs> and I told you, I told him, do you know how much you will be ripping off on that box? I'm like, how much? When I told him, he was like, he went all quiet. He put it back. <laughs> he didn't know what he was playing with. Oh, wow. It was. It was. Uh, it's a. I don't want to say number. But, Whatever, I like to tell my son I go out there and I'll be he'll be in my room and I'll, then I'll grab a little canister off that blue canister right there and be like, you know how much this thing right here is? It's gonna, this is like a, a, a wigs of food. <laughs> like, yeah. Too much money, Dad. Like, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> no, for real. He got like he was playing it like oh when, when I, once I told him like oh, it's a freaking box that is worth around a thousand dollars just the box, <laughs> mm-hmm. just the box. Like, like he was like, oh shoot. he got like went all oh, 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 oh no never mind never mind. So it's funny how sometimes the accessories or just the box boxes, yeah. or I stuff love, like that. I love collecting boxes. I had to get my Castle Grayskull box, and I was ready to pay some good money for it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that Technodrome, I got the Technodrome loose. That one's it. Everything's sealed inside. I got lucky on that one. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But just just the box will run it off. Just up. the box. Uh, mm-hmm. I say the box would be like maybe like two fifty, two hundred bucks. I wanted, I wanted just a, it just uh, just as much as the as the as the place it. No, nah, the place has gone up. <laughs> oh really? It, yeah. They're, they're, the last time you've seen the new but, one coming out, it's a lot smaller yeah, though. Yeah, that's a lot. But yeah, they, now right now what I've seen them sell that there are about three hundred, three hundred and fifty bucks now. Oh. I've seen I've seen some people even ask up to five hundred, which is well. There we go. I got another complete one at home. I'll probably run it for a dollar. There, <laughs> there you go. There you go. Hey. You just have to. You just have to have the right crowd at that right time. Like just two guys running it up. Yeah, but like, I mean, but that's that's what I was getting at. Is is once they see you as a dollar, they're gonna they they expect it all the and time. That, and it's that, a cheap plan. And that and exactly <laughs> and that's that's where that's like man I don't know. Uh-huh. Like I run stuff at a dollar as long as I know. It's, but man, I'm not gonna say the last. It was probably like the. The third to the last time I actually ran, I made some profit, but I didn't make as much as I expected. Mm-hmm. And I, I'd seen that the market right now wasn't 
It right. wasn't. It wasn't good because uh, even my, and I won't lie. I'll be honest. My story wasn't going as good either. It was it was just really slow. Mm-hmm. That's when the gas prices went up. Everything went up. So like, yeah. I just had to. I just had to suck it up and you know. Right, keep, right, right, keep, right. Keep keep paying for the story. You know, keep doing stuff. Well, like, I'll try to run like once a month or once every other month. Like after, after the Texas invasion, mm-hmm. I'm probably not even gonna do one till probably in August. But I got a whole bunch of inventory that I've been picking up some good deals. So I got a bunch of stuff in my room that, you know, I need to get rid of. Mm, okay, nice. okay. You know what I mean? Oh. So, And that's to, just to hold you to, to buy stuff. So whenever you resell, do you, does that automatically go to to your collection, for your collection? Or you say, you know what, I'm going to put this this Aside. amount for, for, for the, to keep buying for, for whatnot. And or, this. Or just mix it up with, with the. Now, how, how do you work yeah, that out? Let's say, um, like, I bought the, the, the Euro shredder and then i made a you know some money off of whatnot then i'll put some money away to for my euro that I, and then the rest i used to you know buy some more stuff mm-hmm. okay, okay and then you know i put it i put it away and then i made my money back that way i pay it off that way yeah mm-hmm. i mean yeah that's i mean I, I guess if you're a reseller and, and, a, and a collector that's the best way of doing it because that's how i kind of mm-hmm. do it too i do the same thing so uh, how, how do you do you listen to reseller? It felt, <laughs> i felt i felt like it felt like like uh, like a reseller's podcast well, yeah because like, you're, you're you're the main but reseller not, but you're, i'm not you're, i'm not you're the reseller of the collector month. first he's a reseller I, of the month i mean I he sold to, more than i all love collecting <laughs> collect is my thing no. but i love to have fun and you know you know get on, on there and just you know it's it's fun yeah the interaction is is, is fun like you it's said fun. the same thing ebay is not the same but i'm gonna tell you like this eBay. You sometimes like you you, fi- eBay, you, find, eBay. you find some good deals. I mean, I ain't gonna lie. He's no, yeah, I've been, I've been on there and I've, I've got some good deals on eBay. What do you think I'm about not Macari? Lie. I don't know. Ah. Macari. I jumped to Macari, made a bunch of steals on there. Huh? Oh yeah, I've got a bunch of good. But you already know there's a bunch of uh, you know people. Yeah, scamming, scamming you know, yeah. So you got to be careful for that. Yeah. But I have gotten some good deals off of there. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this this whole experience kind of like switch my. So what do you, okay, so how do you what do you think? I mean, this, I don't know. I'm looking. I'm looking to to. I mean, because I'm I'm very familiar now with the Japanese market, like so. So you're looking to buy Japanese stuff and reselling it? Or I'm not sure. I, I, I'm looking at a couple of pieces. Like, <laughs> hey, that, that means no, hold on, hold on, because because I'm like, <laughs> this could sell for good here. Like so, now I'm like, seeing it. Jose, so you, the got, mo- you got the, competition, Jose. No, the moment <laughs> I buy one thing. Thinking about reselling, I think that's where I became a, a reseller. Right now, I don't consider myself because I'm not. I didn't buy anything to resell or with the intention to resell. Everybody has their own opinion. I don't feel. But now <laughs> I'm not. Yeah, I'm not lying. Yeah. I feel like I changed my 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 view of kind of like the way that I, I'm looking at stuff. Like, oh, okay. because I, I I've missed a lot of good uh, offers or options where I was like, I don't I don't need it. Mm-hmm. I could have buy it. It's cheap, but I don't need it. I'll let somebody else have it. And I'm like, all right, I'll let it pass. Yeah. But now I'm like, hmm, maybe I can make myself an inventory, like trying to to look for stuff. I mean, you can. I don't know. I don't know. I, I'm just thinking out loud. A lot of people told me, keep it up. You know, that's nice. Thank you for the pieces. I tried to ship next day. Like, I'm trying like, all right, so now that I have the time, kind of like, the business that I do is is slow season, this thing, but I don't know if I'm gonna keep it up when they when when hey, the, the I, I wedding mean, season honestly, comes back I, up. I think I think when it comes to what you, exactly what you said, that Japanese market, you're really good at at finding stuff. I'm trying to, yeah. I mean that's that's rare too. I mean you know yeah. stuff like that. You know people are gonna be looking for. And it's crazy, like you again. know people. You know I've asked for samurai pizza and they're like, what is that? When on, on what now? People don't even know what that is. But yeah, right. but 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 the, but the niche is there, and a lot of people you know people, buy yeah, stuff. But that, that's that's where we, we talk about Facebook. We talk about Instagram. That's 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 something I I'm not gonna tell you what to do, but that's I would recommend you. Well, yeah, into everybody that. tells me that you need to get on Facebook, uh, Nacho. Get on Facebook and check it out over there, and and they'll be sending me a uh, row. Will be sending me like, look at what this is going for. They're trying mm-hmm. to sell this. Or like uh, uh, Raul, Raul, he's really cheap, so he's really good at finding those prices. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, yeah. so we gave him a shout out, and then we gave him a <laughs> shut down. Okay, we lift him up, and now we bring him out. Like, right, no, sorry, no, Raul. No. no, shout out to Raul, Gillo, Ponzarelli. Yeah. So, um, <laughs> yeah, I mean, like I said, it, it is, it, you know, if, if he's, he's telling you that, I mean, it's for a reason. Like I said, he, he yeah, guys, yeah. guys that are like that, that are really, they're not just slanging money everywhere. Yeah. They're they're gonna give you you know they're gonna give you the the best advice they can and I think that's the that's the best way to go when you're talking to somebody that feels that they have all the money in the world and they have the best collection in the world and they right. think they have all you know they have everything you know that those are the ones that you gotta kind of stay away from because 
they're gonna think you know oh, you, you just buy it for me whatever and not give yeah. it to you for a good price so yeah that, that's just the way it goes man you know anyways so guys do you do you think that if something goes south on your businesses or jobs uh do you think you could be a a, a reseller for a full-time job do you think that for, for a main resource of income i don't or? well well you I, go I could tell you for for one i'm that's what i'm that's my goal that's a goal. Oh, that's but, oh, but but okay. but but honestly, the way that I see business wise, I think that you will need to sell more than just vintage for sure. Oh yeah, no, definitely. No, no, that's so a, mm. the I don't think only the passion for, for toys or only it's it's hard if you're trying to sell only what you like. I don't I, I don't I don't think it's a there's a living like a, a, a like a, a whole year around. Maybe there's a season where you can do good, but I don't think the whole year yeah. around only selling what you like. You're just gonna have to start selling things yeah, that, you don't, that you don't that you don't collect, mix and it up. And that's exactly what I said. Remember, uh, I did a Carlos gonna start uh, buying like Funko Lots or Hulk. Hulk uh, like. uh, no, you, you, that's it's, you, you're, you're yeah. absolutely right. No, you know, that <laughs> newer stuff. Yeah, yeah, absolutely right. I mean, mm. I, I like I said, I had I did a, the 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 YouTube with Mac, and I said that myself. When I first opened up the store, I was gonna sell what I like, what I think. Oh man, I know I like this. Everybody else is gonna like this too. And that's when I started understanding. Because, yeah, okay, not right. everybody likes what you like. And exactly. then they're just going to pass and, and, off and your people, booth. People will say, oh, that's cool. For how much? Mm. And that's that's where, yeah. that, that's where like, man, dude, you know. And so that's where I started realizing, okay, if, if I'm going to be serious about this, which I am, I'm going to have to find wholesalers. All that's, all that's in the works already. All that's been talked about. I already have some connects. So Funkos, NECA, newer stuff. That's gonna have to be nice. sold too, because yeah, vintage, vintage of course is my niche, and I, and I have a passion for it. Would you ever consider opening a store? Man, I, I don't, I don't think so. I don't think he so. He probably got I, another I, room. I, no, <laughs> well, like I said, I'm more of a collector. Yeah, but yeah, and, you know, just I, 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 I don't I've, think so. I've dreamt, I've dreamt about it ever since I started. Like, oh, that'd be cool. Like when I started collecting it. Look, I'm not saying that I will do it, but I, I think it's pretty cool. It the, is, when you it? live off of your hobby, which I already I, I did for 25 years now, mm -hmm. like I live out out of one of the passions of my life, which is photography. Like a lot of people know, a lot of people don't. It's not only my job; like it's been my passion for mm -hmm. for years, photography. And then I live off of taking pictures. So that's to me a privilege that I'm very grateful of. Yeah. And not the thing. I feel like I don't know if it's trying to be too greedy with life. To make profit off of the two hobbies that you have, like now, like if I, photography is my is my is one of my hobbies, and then if I can make profits and, and and put a store, put up a store, or something that I like with like toys, I don't know if that's too too much to ask for for life, but that'll be the dream, you know. Like I already have my 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 dream job, mm -hmm. which is living off of my 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 hobby, but now in this one, I don't know. I think another, I, it'll another, be it'll yeah. be. Yeah, I mean, it, yeah, I mean, I say go for it. Yeah. You know, mm. the the worst the worst the worst thing you could you could do is you know if you're not gonna be successful you could at least say you tried and you did you did mm. you didn't I mean that's that's the way I see it. Mm -hmm. I mean, of course you want to be successful. That's that's the main goal. And you're gonna do everything in your power to be successful. But if you if it just doesn't work out for you, it just didn't work out. But at least you can say you can't say I didn't do it. Yeah, that's that's no, that's that's, that's yeah. the way I see it. But someone that's a good seller as releases is on on his business. Do you think that he can be a good seller or something? Well, that what he business we're talking about? We're talking about action figures or photography? Photography. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 yeah, I'm, not, I'm still not that good on, on, on okay. Okay. <laughs> photography. I'm good. I think I'm good. Because you know? he sold figures, you know. He, yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he's talking about he sold figures in two days. So what, what are we I talking I about here? I don't think it necessarily. Uh, I, and I, I feel like I, I don't think it necessarily relates one to another. Is a yes. Me that I'm trying to to like, I've, I've experienced it. Like for example, maybe I can learn more. But in photography, like, I know my worth. I, I have my experience. I know what I've been doing. And I've been doing it for 24, 25, 26 years now. Like, I've been doing it for, for years and years in my, my life. So I, I know how to do a business. I know what are, what, what are the people are looking for. But for this one, I feel like I'm just... Well, I, I, since I haven't seen it as a business, I feel like I'm, I try to move it fast. I, so. I could tell you one thing about this. He says when it comes to Yuli, he when it comes to him having a poker face, I'm bad. He's bad, and that's what's <laughs> gonna kill him. 
for China. <laughs> I, I, I mean, at the end of the day, saying, I feel like, but because yeah. I don't consider my roots, I'm yeah. roots. I, I want to, I, I hunt for, for collecting. I, I hunt to, well, maybe, for maybe. Buying, or, no, you, but, but I'm saying for buying and for selling, whatever it is, when, when you, when you're passionate about something, you sure going to let the world know that you're passionate at that point in time because you get excited. And, and, but that, that, that excitement is also good when you sell. Cause you you can you can uh, you can get them like oh this is cool and then I mean you, you can you, you can, can you can hype it up but at the same time is uh, when you want to buy something that's when you shoot yourself in the foot no that's a, and, and I understand I'm not I'm not saying that I'm good at it like I'm no, not, that, but that, that, I'm that, not saying that I'm trying to do it all that I, like well I feel like once you get that mentality of a reseller I if I know the price that as doesn't much, mean you as much be, as, yeah, it doesn't mean you have to be cold you have to be like no 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 I'm not saying face, that but 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 it's like okay if I'm gonna buy as a reseller. I cannot pay up that price. Exactly. Right. And, and, and the cool thing about Carlos is that whenever he buys something for resale, he offer a resale, reseller price. But whenever he's going to buy something for his collection, he's willing to put up the money. Yeah, and, I've seen people that just make up that. excuses like, "Oh, I'm a reseller." I'm just like, he wants everything for for cheap. Oh, you know, I mean, we got a there's a little, you know, I got a couple of friends that, you know, we get good deals. You know, so yeah. like I said, you know, you meet people. Um, selling and you get those good connections, builds the friendships, and and that's where you could get some good deals and stuff. Like yeah, that I mean, from but them. it's like it's like reseller price. The or maybe you, you know, every, every, everybody, everybody needs. So, like so that. that that's what I do. Like when it comes to when I when, when I stop bidding, when I stop bidding, that's because I'm getting it for the store. But I've said it before. If it's for my collection, I, and I've done it before too, I've bid it over. I know it. I went over because you not, want not, it. not 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 over my price, but over the market value. But because I really want it. I want it for my collection. It's something I've been looking for. We talked about it. You have at, at this, at my level, I have my niche of what I'm looking for. I want it to be clean. It's hard to find clean without rubs or whatever the hell it is. All complete. And then I'll pay up for it. And I've done it before and, I've, and I'm going to keep doing it for my collection. But I'm not going to keep using that tool of this is what we talked about being a good, a good reseller. If you're just going to keep using that tool of I'm a reseller, I'm a reseller. So give it to me for half price or for damn near nothing. That's not the way to go because yeah, then right, then yeah. you're putting a bad 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 look on a reseller and that's why some people don't mm. see resellers as as a good as a good thing. Yeah. That's and, why I'm and, not a reseller. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right guys. Uh we are we have I'm oh, sorry, sorry. No, no, I'm, sometimes I'm, I'll get good deals I don't like I said on my car or whatever and then it, I'm able to sell it pretty cheap. Yeah, and then, you know, uh, and I ain't worried about it. That, but that's what I say the, the percentage is, is good. Yeah, there, so. you you're going to make your profit. I mean me personally, I'm not trying to hit somebody over the head and be like, "Well, if I got it for five bucks and it's worth two hundred, I mean, if, if I get a hundred bucks, cool, you know." You do a good deal. But, nice. but I'm not gonna say, "Hey, I want, I want one hundred eighty dollars or give me two hundred exactly." Nah, yeah, man. If you're making you make know? a profit, you make a you make your profit, right. man. You know, like, one. It doesn't hurt. Let it, let some people get a get a win too. Yeah. All right, guys. All right. So, um, thank you, thank you. I think we're just gonna have to stop here. We. We felt. I, I feel like the conversation went pretty. You know, pretty well, okay. Now, so you 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 were a little nervous. What do you think, man? Because you were talking. You did. No, yeah. no. I feel good. I mean, it's a good experience coming out here with y'all and doing this podcast with everybody. I mean, just, yeah. You know, it's. Uh, I felt good. I yeah, feel yeah, good. Yeah. It was. It's. It was it fun. Was, it was, hopefully, it was a nice experience. Was, I didn't want to turn it down. I thought about it. And then I was like, man, just don't do it. Hopefully, it wasn't it wasn't as painful as you thought it was gonna be. <laughs> it's not gonna hurt that much. Yeah. <laughs> but we still not done with you. No, man, here we go. <laughs> All right, guys. So now, thank you, guys. Thank you for watching. Thank you for for stopping yeah, subscribe, by. Subscribe. Hit that subscribe, like button. Subscribe. Yeah, comment here. My wristlet or not? Is that, is that good or bad thing? Do I keep doing it? Should I open a car lot? Shout out, yeah, shout out, to, shout out to Ignacio. Follow him on Instagram. Yeah, what, what, what are your um? Ignacio JV on whatnot and uh, Hazardous Seven One Three JV Arreal on Instagram. Jesus okay. Lord, I'm you'll see to, my logo. I'm gonna on have there. to write that down. We on the, yeah, that's, on the, a, that's a long one. Yeah, yeah. Just but, you'll see it. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you. Thank you so much. You have, a, have a good one. Keep on hunting. Keep on, keep on the, reselling. Keep on the hobby. <laughs> keep on reselling. All right, guys. Thank you. Appreciate you. Thank you. Bye. Peace. Thank you, brother. Thank you, brother. There you go.